from that and the libraries exist to serve the community's needs by providing access to information and resources regardless of an individual's and community's socioeconomic status or location but are they just edifices that are filled with books or they play a more specific role libraries are often seen as a thing of the past however they are more important than ever before they have become of the most important institutions in societies. They provide everyone access to information and education regardless of socioeconomic status or location and they are often hubs for our local communities. Many young children have found libraries exciting places to be. Libraries exist in physical and digital forms and offer various services including but not limited to books, magazines, newspapers, movies, music, ebooks, audiobooks, databases, and more. Most public libraries also provide computers and other services such as internet access, faxing, photocopying, printing, and scanning. Some libraries also have children's areas, meeting rooms, and reading rooms. Libraries exist to serve communities' needs by providing access to information and resources regardless of an individual's and community's socioeconomic status or location. The Library Week celebration is on the theme, Innovation and Unleashed, Transformative Research Through Exceptional Service Delivery. Right, let's still stay on this matter, expanding the conversation. And joining me in the studio is Donus Wolanyo Boedi. He is the head of research uh, support at Accra Technical University Library. Welcome. Uh, first, let me ask you, what is the importance of, I mean, a library, and then especially now that we are having to celebrate the library week? Libraries are important for several reasons. Actually, we even call libraries the hearts of an academic institution. So in an academic institution, libraries play the role of supporting the mandates of the academic institution, which is learning, teaching, and research. And so at the heart of this, we need all the, we provide the resources, we provide the professional expertise for faculty and staff to be able to, and students to be able to execute this role of the university. So we play a very important role in the university system. But um, let's look at generally, especially with communities where yeah. libraries are situated. You have librarians yeah. doing their work, people doing research, or librarians leading the charge to do research. How do the activities come back to uh, affect the communities, especially, I mean, when I say affect, positively affect communities? So libraries and communities have become a hub for uh, individuals to go and study. There are communities where there are uh, the academic is, the institutions there do not have the resources to be able to provide good, um, do not have the resources to be able to help the children there get what they need. And so these libraries have become a hub for them to be able to go and learn to provide computers and other accessories that these children can use to build themselves up. There are instances where people have become what they have become through the library system and not necessarily even through the school system. So libraries have always within the communities helped people to become what they want to become. Well, so in, in becoming what people want to become, I mean, falling on the libraries, what, uh, if I ask you to uh, bullet maybe one, two or three specific programs or events that uh, people who patronize these libraries have received very well and then has subsequently changed their lives? Yes, yeah, so... Um, we have the materials with the information resources, the books that they get to read. Some of them you will not find in the schools. We have also the, currently the electronic um, information resources that are available. So it's not only books, we have the information resources. We have the tools for research that they can also take advantage of. So libraries provide several tools that you can use. These days we have libraries that have maker spaces. When we talk about maker spaces, we are talking about um, a, a collaborative space where people can go and uh, um, explore their uh, um, artistic and engineering whatever um, skills that they have. So the tools are there, you can go and then uh, experiment with whatever you want to do. And so with these, they are able to uh, build things that they wouldn't get anywhere to build. They get their professional expertise, they get the support that they need to be able to do these things. So these are 
some of the things that libraries are doing within uh, the communities as well. Another issue, I mean, when you are talking libraries, everyone, the mental picture or the vivid picture created is uh, a structure that has books on shelves. I mean, lots of books where people would have to come through. But now we are having to deal with technology, mm -hmm. AI coming in, people using online platforms to assess books and then do their research. So um, how are you leveraging on this? And then um, technology's role in even unleashing all these innovative things that has to do with libraries and their effects? Yeah, so libraries have even been at the forefront of these technologies, using them as a way of making information available and accessible to users. And so libraries are incorporating AI technologies. We are incorporating several technological tools that will give access to users. And we are making it easier for users to be able to access these um, tools to, to do their work. And so we, 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 are, we are very much into technology, and that is what we are making available to users these days. But are there any notable partnerships or collaborations going on? Maybe your library, other people to help people with their research works or um, solve communal problems? For communal problems, what we are doing currently, which is now that we are trying to do that, is with the reading clinics, which is part of our library week celebration. We are doing reading clinics for um, basic schools and donating books to them and then also helping them, taking them through the process so that they build that capacity right from the childhood. But with the, within the academic institutions, what we are, within ATU, for instance, Accra Technical University, what we are doing now is providing them with the tools, the research tools that they need to be able to do their research. Research is a very daunting task. And so when you have technologies that will make it easier for you, it's, 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 it's worth it. And so we are providing these tools. And we, thankfully, management is supporting us in this regard to be able to make it available for faculty members and students to use within the university, yeah. But um, when, when actually is the, li the library week is supposed to start on Monday? Monday yes. That's tomorrow. Yes, the so um, the whole week, what are some of the programs that are outlined to mark this very week celebration? Yes, yeah, so on mo tomorrow, Monday, we do the official launch of the week, and then uh, we'll, we'll have an, an exhibition for the things, the resources, and then the services and products that we have within our library. Then on Tuesday, we'll be having a webinar and then the webinar will be now selling what we have to the general public and then also especially our constituents, which is within the boundaries of ATU. We also want to use that platform to demystify librarianship and then the role of libraries in society. You know, people have this um, uh, mindset about libraries, like you said, and librarians, but we want to demystify that because librarians belong to a broader set of group which we call the information scientists. And we do a lot of things that go just beyond the walls of the library like we see. And so that is what we want to do with this webinar series to demystify that. And then on Wednesday, we have the DEBA itself. The DEBA, we, we, we use the DEBA to launch our new research commons that we have built. And then also our annual newsletter that we do. And so we'll do the launch. The Thursday, we have uh, the reading clinic and then uh, the book, don book donation. And then the Friday, we have some cooking competition quizzes and debates that we have for the students as well. So these are That's on the Friday. On the Friday. Because funny Cook enough, all, all you said, um, pardon me, but I, I'm not really interested in what you said from Monday to Thursday until you hit Friday. Okay. I had food on food, Friday. Yes. So, so um, once so, food, sorry, maybe book. my, I don't know if my news editor is listening, but Friday, I'm not well. <laughs> I'll be going to it. Like uh, yes, yeah, so I will yes. just pass by. But I hope uh, we'll it, give it, you a prawn and then uh, some cooking utensils. You have no problem. No problem. Cooking. I'll be there on Friday. So what would you be cooking? What are you giving me? And name it. And we, I'm we fine. have we have products from Cocoa Processing Company to do the cooking competition. And so, what recipe can you think can do with Cocoa products? Once I get there, anything you give me, I'm good to go. Okay. You don't believe me? You wait to see. <laughs> Well, thank you so much, Olani Boedi, for joining us. Um, and then we say good luck 
for the whole week celebration. And we have free chocolate as well for all those who will be participating. All right. That will be awesome. So for those of you that will be passing by the university campus, you can also join in for the library week celebration. I will be there only on Friday because I know what I am going in for. So once I'm leaving, I leave with um, maybe my food and then whatever book I would want to read. So Donus Bolanyabwedi is the head of research support at the Accra Technical University Library. Now let's move on to other stories. And in recent past, street foods have been an affordable and filling option for many. However, the story has shifted. Meals considered as affordable seem to have gotten a hefty price tag. In this report, we compare the prices of these street foods. <laughs> 